All right, so I know everybody's been wondering, what about Bob's nuts? Well, let's look in the fridge, and sure enough, they have started to sprout. You can get your nuts to sprout in a plastic bag by just keeping them wet. And I know the other question is, what about the ones that were floaters? These ones were sinkers, and, and these ones, are the floaters this is the one also that had the uh the bug in it the larva or whatever it's called the weevil is it a weevil i don't know what it's called but the little white maggot looking thing these ones are a little moldier but as you can see there is one that sprouted so what we're going to do is we're going to put them in pots and because we're trying to keep our costs down we are going to use something that's cheaper than pots we're going to use plastic cups so Went to the store. The only thing we have to do is make a little minor, minor adjustment to these is we gotta put a drain hole in them. The easiest way to do this is to grab a drill, got our stack of cups, and then we're just gonna put it right in the end of this one. Comment down below how many you think we're gonna get through. wasn't very straight by the way but we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven twelve thirteen thirteen so basically we got halfway through the stacks so now we got to do that to the other stack okay uh, we got our holes drilled in there they're drilled all the way through see drilled all the way through from one end to the other. And then we just gotta put our dirt in there. We've already gotten some with dirt in them. So what we're going to do is we're going to set our nuts in the dirt. So we're gonna take this, and normally you would plant them with the flat side down, so that's what we're going to do. It's gonna kinda put it in there so the nut's somewhat covered. Push it down a little bit. And then we're gonna do that with all the cups that we have here. See this one, see how, see that one's sprouted a lot. Yeah, I kind of got behind on this, and as you can see, this one's got both the, the up and the down one, so I don't really know which way it's supposed to go. One of these is supposed to go down, and then one's supposed to grow up, so we're just going to put this one flat down and see what happens. But we're going to do that with all the cups, and then we'll check back later, okay? I'm super excited about this. I'm surprised they all grew. I mean, I had two bags of nuts and almost every single one of them sprouted. So far, we're doing better than expected. So I got 39 in cups right here. So we got 39 of them. There's still some left in the bag, so I'm just gonna leave the bags out in the garage just to get them out of the refrigerator. And it's still kind of cold, so hopefully some more will sprout. But, um. And I'll shortly, um, shortly I'm gonna sneak them into the laundry room so that I can keep an eye on them and the cat doesn't get to them. Keep checking back. We'll keep posting update videos of how the, the chestnuts are doing and how the girls' flower garden and beanstalks are doing. If you haven't checked out the uh, girls planting their beanstalks, you can click the link right there. If you wanna see more videos, you can subscribe right here. And if you're thinking about growing chestnuts yourself, give us a thumbs up and um, leave a comment down in the comment section. Thanks for watching.